In the animal kingdom, the act of mating is not just about reproduction. It's a sophisticated dance, a fierce competition, a test of strength and endurance, and in some cases, even a display of artistic prowess. Each species, in its own unique way, tries to ensure the survival of their genes, and the methods they employ are nothing short of remarkable. Take for instance the intricate dance rituals of many bird species. These are not just spontaneous expressions of joy, but well-rehearsed performances aimed at attracting a mate. From the vibrant plumage of the peacock to the rhythmic moves of the mannequin, each bird has its own distinctive style and flair. In contrast, consider the world of lions. Here, the competition for a mate is fierce and often brutal. Males engage in bloody battles for dominance, their roars echoing across the savanna. The victor gains the right to mate, ensuring his strong genes are passed on to the next generation. And let's not forget the undersea world where creatures like the anglerfish take a more bizarre approach. The tiny male attaches himself to the female, slowly merging with her body and becoming a permanent part of her. This ensures that when the time comes, she has a mate ready to fertilize her eggs. Such examples only scratch the surface of the myriad mating strategies found in the wild. From the dance of the spiders to the romantic serenades of frogs, from the synchronized flights of dragonflies to the complex courtship of wolves, every corner of the animal kingdom is brimming with fascinating tales of survival and reproduction. As we can see, the world of animal mating is as diverse and fascinating as the creatures that inhabit it. So let's dive deeper into this intriguing world and unravel the mysteries it holds. From the intricate dance of the birds of paradise to the impressive displays of peacocks, Let's dive deeper into the world of animal courtship. In the heart of the tropical rainforests, we find the birds of paradise, captivating creatures known for their elaborate courtship rituals. Males, with their strikingly vibrant plumage, perform an intricate dance that involves a series of hops, twists and turns, all while showing off their dazzling feathers. This dance, a spectacle in itself, is the male's way of wooing a potential mate. In the savannas, a different courtship spectacle unfolds, the African elephant males, or bulls, engage in a ritual known as must. This is a period of heightened aggression and excessive testosterone levels, where the males showcase their strength and dominance to attract females. The display of power, though intimidating, is an essential part of their mating ritual. Now, let's travel to the colder regions. Here, emperor penguins have a unique way of courtship. The male presents the female with a carefully selected pebble, akin to a proposal. If she accepts, they become partners for the season, sharing the responsibility of nurturing their chick in the harsh Antarctic climate. And who can ignore the vibrant displays of peacocks? The males fan out their magnificent tail feathers, creating a mesmerizing display of colors and patterns. This fan dance is not just about beauty, it's a signal of genetic fitness, a visual testament to the male's health and vitality. In the insect world, fireflies light up the night with their bioluminescent signals. Each species has a unique pattern of flashes, which males use to attract females. It's like a Morse code of love in the insect world. Each of these courtship rituals, as diverse as they are, shares a common goal, to attract a mate and ensure the continuation of the species. These elaborate rituals not only showcase the beauty and complexity of the animal kingdom, but also highlight the importance of mating and the survival of a species. After the courtship dance and mating, what comes next? you might be wondering. Well, for our animal friends, the journey is far from over. It's time to transition from the world of courtship to the realm of parenthood. Let's start with the period immediately following mating. For many animals, this means pregnancy. In the animal kingdom, pregnancy durations can vary wildly. For instance, the African elephant holds the record for the longest gestation period, a staggering 22 months. On the other hand, the Virginia opossum, a marsupial, has one of the shortest gestation periods, a mere 12 days. Regardless of the length of pregnancy, one thing is certain. Preparation for the arrival of offspring is crucial. Animals go to extraordinary lengths to ensure the safety and well-being of their future progeny. Consider birds, for example. Many species construct intricate nests to provide a safe haven for their eggs. Some, like the weaver bird, weave complex structures out of twigs and leaves. Others, like the burrowing owl, prefer to remodel abandoned burrows, adding their personal touch to make it a cozy home for their chicks. Then, there are mammals like the beaver, which build impressive lodges with underwater entrances to protect their young from predators. 
Similarly, foxes dig dens, often under tree roots or in abandoned burrows, to provide a safe and warm environment for their kits. And let's not forget sea turtles. After mating, the females embark on an arduous journey back to the beach where they were born to lay their eggs. They dig a hole in the sand, deposit their eggs, and cover them up before returning to the sea, leaving the hatchlings to fend for themselves once they emerge. From building nests to preparing dens, animals go to great lengths to ensure the safety and well-being of their future offspring. Such dedication and effort underscore the significance of parenthood in the animal kingdom. Once the offspring arrive, how do animals take on the role of parents? This question leads us into a world of diverse parenting strategies that animals employ to ensure the survival and thriving of their young ones. Let's start with orangutans, the nurturing caretakers of the animal kingdom. Orangutan mothers in particular are remarkable for their dedication. They spend nearly a decade teaching their offspring how to survive in the wild. From foraging for food to constructing a cozy nest for the night, every skill is meticulously taught and learned over the years, reflecting the profound bond between the mother and her child. Next, we turn to the mighty elephants. Their parenting strategy is a communal effort. When a calf is born, it's not just the mother who takes care of it. The entire herd becomes a protective shield around the little one, warding off predators and guiding the calf through the complex social dynamics of the herd. This group parenting approach ensures the calf's safety and social development. Then we have the dolphins, the teachers of the sea. Dolphins are known for their intelligence, and this extends to their parenting too. Dolphin mothers teach their young how to hunt and use tools, such as sponges, to protect their noses while foraging on the ocean floor. This teaching behavior not only equips the young dolphins with necessary survival skills but also underlines the importance of learning and adaptation in the animal kingdom. Across the spectrum, parenting strategies in the animal kingdom are as diverse as the animals themselves. Some are nurturers, some are protectors, and some are teachers. But all of them share a common goal, to ensure the survival and growth of their offspring. In the wild, parenting isn't just about producing offspring, it's about equipping them with the skills they need to survive and thrive. The bond between parent and offspring in the animal kingdom is powerful and essential for the survival of the young. From courtship dances to nurturing their young, animals display a wide variety of behaviors in their journey from mating to parenting. It's a circle of life that is as captivating as it is complex. Over the past few minutes, we've journeyed through a world that is often unseen and unappreciated, a world that is brimming with life and love in its own unique ways. We started our journey by exploring the intriguing world of animal mating. We saw how animals, from the smallest insects to the largest mammals, have evolved intricate rituals and behaviors to attract mates. From the vibrant displays of peacocks to the haunting songs of whales, each species has its own unique way of expressing its readiness to procreate. We then moved on to the captivating world of the mating dance. Here we saw the elaborate choreography performed by various species, each dance as unique as the species performing it. From the synchronized flights of starlings to the intricate footwork of bowerbirds, these dances are a testament to nature's creativity and diversity. From mating, we transition to parenthood, another complex and fascinating aspect of the circle of life. We explored how animals go to great lengths to protect and nurture their young, from the tireless efforts of penguin parents braving harsh Antarctic winters to the nurturing care of orangutans in the lush rainforests.